stomach bacteria change your brain and behavior. The notion that the state of our gut governs our state of mind dates back more than 100 years. The emerging concept of the gut microbiome as a key regulator of brain and behavior opens up a new horizon in neuroscience. Precise targeting of the microbiome gut brain exists with psychobiotics as a novel approach for the management of stress-related conditions. Psychobiotic are live microorganisms in the gut, when ingested in adequate amounts, have a potential to change the mood and mental health. Psychobiotic act on the brain-gut axis, a biological network connecting the intestinal and endocrine system in the brain that process stress, such as the HPA axis. Taking a probiotic strain of bifidobacterium longum reduced physiologic and psychological stress and led to a modest improvement in memory. Bifidobacterium longum strain is a putative psychobiotic with beneficial effects on stress-related behaviors, physiology, and cognitive performance. Gerard Clark, Ph.D., from the Alimentary Farm Abiotic Centre, University College Cork, Ireland, presented the study findings on October 18 at the Society for Neuroscience 2015 annual meeting at Chicago. The study has found a reduction in cumulative output of the stress hormone cortisol, as well as a blunted increase in subjective anxiety. People reported being less stressed and anxious while taking the probiotic. They also showed subtle improvement on a visual memory task after receiving the probiotic as well as an altered EEG output. The results highlighted the importance of the interaction between the gut and the brain. A better understanding of this link will form new strategies for preventing and treating many psychological disorders. The microbiome is a very good target because it can be manipulated. It's very difficult to change the human genome that we get from our parents. But we do have ways of changing the microbiome. For that we have antibiotics, we have probiotics, and changes in diet will do this as well. This is really a very exciting area because it might allow us to do something against depression and other psychiatric maladies. Microbial world influencing the development of brain and behavior will be one of the great frontiers of clinical neuroscience in the next decade. Thank you.